Hello. There are four Mercury retrograde motions this year, and the first one begun on the 9th of January and goes on till the 25th of January. It's retrograde in Capricorn. And Mercury retrograde, as we know, throws everything into some sort of confusion or disarray, either slight or extreme, depending on what it's aspecting elsewhere. So in Capricorn, Mercury affects logistics of every kind. It will destabilise um, arrangements and plans, practical arrangements, practical developments, practical plans, because Mercury through Earth signs is concerned with that which is material or concrete, that which has become concretized. So at a practical level, rather than just a, a mental level or an emotional level, um, things are delayed or they are in some way disturbed. And again, it's a, it's a matter of degree to, as to how much this happens. And this, this particular retrograde motion goes on until the 25th of January, when the dust starts to settle. And even so, it's towards the middle of February when things even out and we can trust that that what was, if you like, destabilised or, or put on a back burner or delayed in some way is actually back on track. And at the same time as this Mercury retrograde motion in Capricorn in January, Mars is passing through Scorpio. So this deepens the influence of um, what Mercury is actually um, examining or, or, or excavating or throwing up. And together, these two planetary motions bring a depth of planning and understanding that, that wasn't there before, that is actually needed to various sectors of life. So things like industry, transport, service areas, very affected. And of course, individually, depending on your chart, various of your own life issues. So the start of the year, and the end of the year are like bookends because where Mercury retrogrades in January, it will also finish the year retrograde in Capricorn in December. So both um, both are they're like bookends. Mercury in Capricorn begins and ends a year of vital regrouping or renewing of the infrastructure of certain things that otherwise will will not last or won't won't stand on good legs so what happens in january is very important and i, I and i talked about this in a, in a different video um mars through scorpio because um there are sequels to what happens in january there are sequels in june and things are things in june which are at a very at a second very vital stage are only as good as as, as what is um, detailed or what is understood and planned in the January. So 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 the story as it begins in January picks up speed as the year unfolds and as the year goes on and ends in December by completing a full circle, courtesy of Mercury retrograde. And hopefully this contains the final logistics of the personal plans, the final logistics, so that what you have, what we have hopefully, which is tentative in terms of change or terms of re regrouping and restructuring, will be absolutely positively known to be the right thing in December if the other Mercury retrograde motions are followed. And I'll do another video about the second one, which will occur at the end of April. Now, I'll talk about that in April. OK, thank you. If you would like your own chart examining, then please go to www.perceptivity.co.uk and um, find more details or contact us. Thank you.
bu akşam seminerimizi canlı olarak mobil uygulamamız üzerinden yapıyoruz. 